Welcome back to the Zodiac Sign Fragrance Guide and today we're talking about Gemini. Gemini goes from May 21st to June 21st. Now here's the thing about Gemini. If you want to win their nose, you have to do this by surprising them with a mixture of notes. Gemini, also known as the twin sign, is known to have two strong personalities. So these air signs will typically not have a signature scent. Rather, their fragrance collection will be very diverse due to their experimental nature. And because of that, I'm choosing in my recommendation uh, fragrances with woody and floral undertones in order to complement their dual personality. Starting off with the guys, my recommendation for Gemini male is Tom Ford Ombre Leather. Now, while not super woody in the first place, but there's definitely this leathery uh, scent, as the name says, Tom Ford Ombre Leather, that I still think works for this specific sign. And overall, I think it's just a great scent, so you almost can't go wrong. It's very animalistic, and uh, but it also has this spicy and white floralish scent profile that I would really recommend to my male Gemini friends. The notes include cardamom, leather, jasmine, uh, amber and moss and patchouli. So relatively simple, but sometimes simple is the best. The performance of this fragrance I think is really good. I get eight to nine hours off of it and the projection is about a foot to two feet. So if I smell it on my hand and you know when I'm writing uh, or I got my hands away from me, I don't really like smell it constantly, but when I whiff it around like I'm doing right now, it's all over the place and I, I like it because the performance really lasts for a long time. So it reminds me of, of that feeling that I get, which I love with, uh, you know, leathery fragrances in general. So overall, it's a little bit more on the expensive side. It's a Tom Ford, but I think it's worth it. However, again, you should check it out in store or maybe get a decant somewhere online. Whether you're a biker or you're a CEO, I think you can pull this one off. And if you're not familiar with Tom Ford Ombre Leather or you would like to have an alternative, try checking out Colonia Leather EDC Concentré by Aqua di Parma. I think it's a great alternative as well. It has similar notes and uh, maybe you know this one instead of Tom Ford or you want to try something else. So those are my two recommendations for male Gemini. If you like this video so far, make sure to spray that like button and share it across social media. It would help me a lot. Moving on to our female friends in the Gemini sign. And for those, I am going with Kim Kardashian by Kim Kardashian. I think generally for our female Geminis, I wanted to have a fragrance that combines orange, uh, gardenia and sandalwood or something like that and, and this one is pretty good in that however the tuberose uh, note seems to stick out a little bit more than I would want but I think still this is a great choice for Gemini female friends this fragrance is not very expensive um, some people actually think that it smells much much more expensive than it is um, the performance, however, is not that good. I heard that you only get about three hours out of it. Just be very liberal when you are spraying yourself and it won't break your bank. As it dries down, it tends to get a little bit sweeter. And again, because it's a woman's fragrance, I think there's nothing wrong with that. But th with that being said, the woody notes, in my uh, experience, kind of get drowned out over time. I think a great alternative here, if you don't know what Kim Kardashian by Kim Kardashian smells like, or you wanted to try something else instead, it, it would be Suede by Michael Kors. So check that one out. That has very similar notes. And if you, maybe you know this one, but you don't know the other one or the other way around. So here are two things that I would actually recommend for Gemini. What do you think, guys? Are you Gemini? Do you agree or disagree? Like and share this video if you found it interesting and I will continue linking the other videos of this series right up here and I'll see you in the next one.